So first to two. Joined at the hip once again in the booth, John Rowling and Vassus Alexander. A 22-year-old against a 42-year-old in the first round of the Women's World Championship, but it's the 22-year-old with all the lakeside experience, Fallon Sherrick, the seventh seed. He's a former finalist here. Olive Oil from Inverness is 42 years of age. Yet to win a ranking title, and she's making her lakeside debut. 22-year-old Fallon Sherrick is the seventh seed. Is the seventh seed here? Runner-up in the World Masters of 2014, as well as the World Championship of 2015. So Olive has the darts, the Ugandan-born darts player. And speaking to Paul Nicholson, he fancies her to produce a little bit of an upset here. Fallon Sherrick's big year was 2015, not really been firing quite at that sort of level since. She was briefly world number one that year. Settler down into the match, nice third dart. By McCarma based up in Inverness nowadays. Had a very busy 2016 Fallon Sherrick in terms of her darts. Won just the one title in Japan, retaining her Japan Open title. And reached one other final in France. Dieter Hedman beat her in the French Open final. Been a member of the England team since 2015. 84. Part of the WDF World Cup looking team who took the trophy that year in Turkey. Idiosyncratic sway to her right as she throws by a Makama. So 102 with the throw. Andy last dart. Double 18, she's left herself with that treble 17. Yes, it is in. Yes, 36 are required. And one more dart at it. The breaker throw. I pulled it. Oh, that was a big hoik. Double 16 for the opening leg of the first set. And there it is. By McCarma is ahead, holds a throw. She is officially the world number 291. 16. Do a ranking a bit of good if she wins this one. 
26. Lisa Ashton, an impressive winner earlier on. She will face the winner of this one in the quarterfinals. Ref referee is splendidly attired out up there, I have to tell you. Anthony Mr. Dundas. Mr. Dundas, he's got... Look at those, look at that. Come on, where do you pick those up? Your sort of stuff, that muscles? Absolutely, John. Just be careful as you've done you where you wear those, don't you? This is the place. to square it off with the throw. 18 now gives her the tops for a 118 checkout. 78. Ball of unit power 125. 65 required. Tops now, good dart. For a 125, yes. It's on, it's on. Trust me. Red bit at the top of the board. Top she wants. 85. Wow, that missed by a distance. Found you required 40. Only just in the board. 80. Needs to hit a double here, Fallon. So to calm herself down. That's five misses so far. Yes, Lee that's good. Leg, Did well just to compose herself before throwing that Game final one. dart. So 1-1. One, one. First to two sets wins this. And in the women's format, winning the opening set is so crucial. 85. By Makama with the advantage of throwing first in this opening set. And we were talking about those uh, those shoes, and apparently he was heard making the observation that those magnificent shoes, they call those spats, I don't know, they almost look like golf shoes, don't they? They've got some serious shine on them, and uh, John Boy was saying that, would it put the players off? Whoa, you catch a glimpse of those, it. retina damage. Hello. 140. Roger Federer was once asked not to wear shoes which had orange soles at Wimbledon because they contravened the predominantly white rule. 41.
Sherrick very much in a good position for the break of throw now. 55 when she returns. 45. Now then, Bayamakama's a long way back, so she's got masses of time. Tops. Good marker. 15. Mm. See if you can do it for the second time of asking. One out of eight so far for Fallon Sherrick. Double ten. Game shot on the third line. And that's a good check out. And so she gets the break of throw and now has the darts for the opening set. Started to find a scoring midway through that last leg. The scoring that took her all the way to the final 16. two years ago she lost 3-1 to Lisa Ashton Olive looks really nervous up there 40. understandable but she does look very tense Ugandan, originally from sorry I think we were about to say the same thing John so you carry on Ugandan born is uh, Olive and I think there's 27. a Ugandan flag out there in the crowd somewhere Scottish flag alongside her on the score that you see there. One hundred and twenty three. Well, there's the flag of Scotland and the flag of Uganda. Proud now of both, I'm sure. Eighty five. Switch time. Well, 41. I can't believe that she decided to stay there, but stay there she did, and probably paid the price. 85. Philly, Fallon's sister, sister Philomena, to give her a Sunday best. It is Sunday. So this is for the set. Shanghai on the 20s. It uh, wasn't the best. 146 then for Bayamakama. Best check out 32. Sharik's best check out 40. And she is really struggling with the noise in the crowd and actually concentrating. Nobody trying to put her off, it's just the general hubbub, I think. 60. Fallon, you require 92. Treble 20. Oh no, she's gone the ball route. 10 for double 16. For the set. Yes. On the first set. Very Fallon. nicely done. First blood to the seventh seed. Fallon Sherrick, the 22-year-old, wraps up the first set with a mighty impressive checkout. And she has one foot into the quarterfinals. She's halfway there. Quarters earlier, Christoph Ratajski, just too strong for Villa Mandigas in the preliminary round of the men's 3-2 winner up against Wesley Harms. When the two ladies that will be back on stage in a moment are done, we've got another preliminary round match between Raymond Smith of Australia and the Belgian David Van Balen. 
And then in the first round, a cracker in prospect, Jamie Hughes and Martin Atkins. They will round us off later. But let's see if uh, there's a way back here for Olivia Makama, or can Fallon Cherok get the job done? Back we go to Rawley and Vassos. Thank you. It is a long way back from a set down, but it's not a long way back from a set down. Fallon Sherrick has the darts at the start of this second set, and it is only the first to two sets through to the quarterfinals. Second set, first leg, Fallon to throw first. Game on. Bayou Makama will just hope to score an awful lot better than she did in that first 39. set. Averaging just 63 with her first nine darts. Lisa Ashton's match earlier on was close in the first uh, first of the sets and then she absolutely ran away with it in the second and I just wonder whether Fallon might do similarly now. Much more experienced and clearly more at home up there. She's not throwing particularly well by her own standards. She's only averaging around about 70, but she seems very much more comfortable 60. than Olive Bayamakama. Better. One hundred and twenty one. Fifty nine. One hundred. That's a couple of decent visits and showing us what she is capable of producing. 137. Yes, yeah, she's a very decent player. 85. But yet to win a ranking title compared with Fallon's 13 through her career. Still only 22 years old, Fallon. Just checking the scoreboard. 135. She didn't want to 15. All of the other prior 154. So 51 then for the opening leg for Fallon Sherrick. I think she'd go 11 here for tops. Oh, she's gone 19. What do I know? Double 16. Double 8. 43. All of you require 94. Treble 18 for tops, you would think. Treble 14 tops or... Oh, double 11 she's left. For a 94 checkout. 72. Well, it was a bizarre way to go for it, but she wasn't too far away from that double 11. Double 4 now for Sherrick, double 2. Close. Team and a good adjustment. Fallon Sherrick. Seven leg olive to throw first. Game on. She's only had four darts at a double so far. But that's a lot better. That's her first turn 40. Done by way of response. I think if Mayamakama doesn't hold a throw here, it might be just about curtains with the Robin Hood shot there. A little shake of her head, she knew that was heading towards the treble, but instead just whacks into the back of the previous start. 95. Bosch. Starting now to show us the dance she's definitely capable of. Is it too late? Well, that's as good as the maximum. Sherrick will be the first one to have a crack at a checkout. 
and to go 2 0 up with a break of throw. 45. Following in a by 132. Six starts, Vassos. Bullseye for double 16. She will be back. 25. 92. Leaving tops. I'm telling you what, that 25 was a good duck. Checked with the uh, referee what was required and got the 25. So now tops required for 2 0. Yes, one leg away now, Fallon Sherrick. Third leg, Fallon to throw first. Followed by Makama hasn't done herself justice here tonight. Fallon Sherrick now with the darts to close her out of the match. Great start. Fallon came here as the second seed last year and lost in round one. I know she's keen 26. not to repeat that trick. And it looks like she won't. Four turn forties. Uh, Makama looks upwards as much as to say, why of all days am I just missing by fractions and not Easy hitting five. the numbers I want? There at last is the treble 20. Looking just about over this match, Vassos. It really is, John. 123. Is it all too late? That's a good visit, but... She's found a range, she's found a rhythm, the seventh seed. And she's on a finish when she comes back. These could be Olive's last three darts at Lakeside this year. Well, we'll see, 110. Be a nice way to finish it. She's got six darts from here. Might go treble 18, double 18. That was what she was looking for. Now, what we do now? 12s, maybe, possibly 20s. Oh, good dart. So double six for the match for Fallon. There it is. Shot and the match. Fallon Shadow. Comprehensive. Cool as you like. Olive by Makama never really showed her best darts. We saw glimpses of them, but not regularly enough. And Fallon Sherrick advances through to the quarterfinals where she will meet Lisa Ashton. We can all afford to that.